Good evening YouTube and good evening to all of you fishing and outdoor addicts out there. This is Roy Dallas with Roy Dallas Fishing and I just wanted to put a quick one together for you to share with you my experiences at this year's Toronto Outdoors and Adventure Show. I went to this year's show with just one thing in mind and that was to replace my cold sandwich based fishing lunches with a warm home cooked style meal. Something that will be nutritious and filling, be ready to eat in under 20 minutes and give me the level of energy I needed to fight the big game fish here in the great outdoors. I searched the show for possible solutions and came up with something both fitting and interesting. So I wanted to share that with you all. Here's Dallas Jr. with our top picks from the show. Hello everyone, this is um, Dallas Jr. Um, I'm actually really bored. Uh, my dad kicked me off the PlayStation so I've come to talk to you guys. Problem solved. Whoop. This is a home cooked meal in a bag ready for you to eat. Freeze dried meals, also called MREs, which are prepared in either Canada or the United States are my top picks. They're super easy to prepare, light to carry, and pack the nutritional punch you'll need to keep you on your game all day long. There are many brand choices and dishes to pick from. Personally, I don't trust any meal unless I know it has been prepared with the strict regulations adhered to in Canada or the United States. To prepare this MRE, all you need are two cups of boiling water. To boil my water either on the ice or in the bush, I'll need an outdoor cooking stove and the right materials to create the heat. Here's how I'll be putting it together and eating my meal in under 20 minutes flat. Now kids, don't try this without the explicit permission of your parents as it involves fire and you could be very badly hurt if something goes wrong. This is my outdoor kid stove. It weighs a mere 360 grams. It's made out of titanium which is the same type of metal used to make airplanes so it's super light and easy to carry and fits into this tiny compact bag. It's 100% Canadian made right here in Ontario and I wouldn't have it any other way. There's no way I'm preparing my food with some product made anywhere else because I want to know with 100% certainty that there are no harmful agents in these materials that could end up in my food or in the environment. Only Canadian and American products give me that sort of peace of mind. To fire up my stove, I'm going to use the world's best survival fire starter. Again, this product is made here in Canada by a company called Quickwick of all natural materials and contains absolutely no fuels, chemicals or other garbage you might find in fuel based starters, especially those that might be manufactured overseas. Quickwick is a local manufacturer owned and operated by a family that has not only served in our armed forces, but to this day contributes back to the community by supporting local families and charities. Here's Casey Wall with a little more information about this product. All right, hey folks, we're here at the Outdoor Adventure Show and uh, we're here with some fire starters, quick, quick fire starters. One fire starter will burn for 30 minutes with an 8 to 10 inch flame and is guaranteed to start your campfire, wood stove, fireplace without killing their newspaper. It'll even light when wet and it'll withstand up to 90 kilometer winds. So we're out here at booth 254, having a great time at the Outdoor Adventure Show. Here we have uh, individual units we're handing out for free at the Outdoor Adventure Show. We also sell a four pack, uh, $5 for the show, and we also got them in bulk at uh, 50 boxes. You can check out our website at www.quickwick.com. We're 100% made in Canada. Uh, we take pride in that. Uh, and also a portion of all proceeds go to planting trees in Ontario. It's a big campaign that we're going. It's called Hashtag Keep the Campfire Alive. Uh, we do ship to the US and across Canada. By combining these two products, I boiled two cups of water required to rehydrate my meal in under three minutes. Poured the hot water into the bag and let sit for 10 minutes after mixing per the instructions on the bag. Since I only used about half the fire starter by the time I was done, I attempted to put out the fire using freezing cold ice water and to my surprise, it kept on burning. That day on the ice, we had 40 km an hour winds, which did little to put out the fire. 
I was really impressed at the quality of both of these products. Casey and the Wall family. On behalf of my channel, and I'm sure that I speak for everyone in the community here in Ontario, thank you for serving in our armed forces, for making a safe, reliable product that we can all enjoy, and for giving back to our community. May God bless your family and your business. I sincerely wish you all the best. Thanks for watching our video, guys. Go ahead and give our hot lunch solution a try. I'll leave a link in the description below for all the products that you've seen in this video. I read all of your comments, so don't be shy. Leave one below, give us a thumbs up, and subscribe to our channel. We'll see you on the next video. Stick around for the entertainment roll coming up right now. So I'm out of here with nothing to show for. Sorry guys, but we're gonna have to uh, maybe just get some filming done today. Dallas out. Good evening to all. Scratch that, take two. Fight these game favorites. It's actually so embarrassing. We're gonna, he's gonna see it while he's editing. He's probably gonna put it in the video somewhere in the middle. Bloopers at the end. I'm having the time of my life. <laughs>